Hey everybody, it's Chris Doyle at Alderman Chevrolet Buick GMC in Rutland, Vermont. You know, when folks are researching vehicles, trying to figure out what they want to get next, there are a lot of considerations that they have. There are fun ones. There's design, there's what really grabs you, but there's a lot of practicality too. It's gotta be a car that makes sense for you. You gotta have room, you gotta have comfort. You don't want people sitting on top of each other on the inside, especially in a part of the world like this. It's gotta handle winter weather very well. It's a reason why SUVs are so popular. As a matter of fact, here, as you know, is the Buick Encore GX. This is the newest lineup to the Buick SUV line. Very popular car. Lots of room, lots of space, very comfortable, great in the winter. It'd be nice if there was an electric version of it, right? I mean, but the problem with those EVs are they're small, can't fit a whole lot of people in them. They don't really do well in the winter, right? Uh, not necessarily. Take a look. This is the Chevrolet Bolt sitting next to it. Well, it's a smaller car. I mean, this isn't going to be a fair comparison, right? Chevy Bolt, some little EV versus an SUV. It's going to be smaller. You're not going to have the same room, right? Not necessarily for that either. In fact, if you think that the Bolt has less space on the inside for passengers in terms of cubic volume, which is the best way to measure it, you'd be wrong. The Bolt has more, not a whole lot more, about a tenth of a foot. But believe me, for a car that's that much smaller on the outside, it might surprise you to th see that there is more room inside the Bolt for people than even the Buick Encore GX. Well, how is that even possible? Take a look. This is an EV. You're using less space for the engine. Powertrain is taking up less room. When you open the inside of the car, you're going to see a couple of things. Very, very flat four. You're looking at very high ceilings on the inside. Same thing goes for the back here. A lot of room. A lot of room, leg room, head room, shoulder room, big door openings. Never underestimate that. If you got room but you can't get inside, you got to squeeze up like an accordion. What's the point? Very easy to get into and out of the car. And the other thing is, I'm going to hop inside, close the door, so I can show you one other thing that really stands out in the bolt. Now, these days, in the interest of aerodynamics and safety, it seems like the windows keep getting smaller and smaller and smaller, and sometimes they can cut off what you're seeing outside. That is not the case with the Chevrolet Bolt. Huge, huge amount of glass space, even something as thoughtful as these little corner windows here, means it's really a panoramic room. There is a huge windshield in the front. Very easy to see, good visibility. Check out the size that you've got back here. Again, lots of room in the back seat as well as the front. And you kind of have the best of both worlds because you've got a car that has plenty of room on the inside, but is very compact. Easy to drive, easy to park on the outside. Oh, and one other thing too. I mentioned winter driving. Now we're in Vermont, so you want to make sure that you've got something that can handle just about everything that Mother Nature can throw at you. Now this is one of those EVs. It's not going to work well, right? You're going to have some problems driving in the wind. Some flimsy little EV driving down the road. <laughs> flimsy is the wrong word for the bolt. This car weighs more than this one. And that's important. Traction control, stability control, all of the great technologies that help you in the winter, they're wonderful, but sometimes good old physics makes a difference. And when you've got a car that is as heavy as the Bolt is, with the weight balanced so nicely because of that big lithium ion battery running underneath the car, you have what is without a doubt the best front wheel drive winter car certainly that we sell oh and one other thing too you need to defrost those windows nothing nothing we have on our lot defrosts windows in the winter faster than this car it's fun to drive the technology is great it's great looking vehicle but it's practical too all of that wrapped up with an ev it's a winning package. If you want to learn more, come visit us. Alderman Chevrolet in Rutland, Vermont.